little reactions here. I'm gonna just steer us away from yeah. that. Thing. This is so nice to have a pro kayaker as a friend because when you're out rafting, she will save your life. We'll show them what we're about to go into. Yeah, we're about to go into some sort of, I don't know what this is called in English. Boy, you want help? Yeah. With a no. horse? Oh, no, we're good. We're good. I told you she's a pro kayaker, so. Yeah. Fuck! We're fucked? <laughs> YOLO! High on or. Oh shit, that's cool. Let's not run over that guy. Can you hold this again? Yeah. Do you want to film him? Oh, hey! Yeah. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> that's really cool. That's so dope. Syrac is such a dope city. Yeah. A rock, but we're not gonna get stuck. And then the pro kayaker saved it. <laughs> this is how I kayak with my, like, my high kayaking wow. community. <laughs> wow. They would be pretty ashamed. <laughs> so I saw that a lot of people online were like looking for engineering vlogs. So I thought I would start one. I don't know, but the thing is, is that I don't think it's really interesting to see like engineers studying. I mean, it's kind of cool because I live in Switzerland and I think that would be, I guess, a cool thing to share, like what it's like studying in Switzerland. But I'm literally just like doing turbulent flows notes for my exam. And here are my laser diagnostics notes, like hardcore. Currently just checking my flame. It's not supposed to be doing that, by the way. If someone wants to explain turbulent flows to me, I mean like I know it, but now I'm doing turbulent flows modeling, just going over the Reynolds stress models, which I mean, I, I get them. I just don't want to like learn all of the terms like pressure, rate of strain, tensor. I mean, that one's not that bad, but then, ugh. I don't want to do all of this tensor algebra. Can someone do it for me? But in other words, my flame is looking better. So I'm on my way to the Kreisbüro to get my um, visa extended because I'm a student. And this is my house. It's a student house. It's not my mansion, unfortunately. Great thing is that I have this view. Okay, so I thought it would be interesting, or not interesting, like good, to like just give a background of my engineering. And I've never vlogged before. It's really weird because people are watching me, people are driving. Um, but basically I uh, did my bachelor's in mechanical engineering at, um, where did I go? McGill University in Montreal. And now I moved to Switzerland to do my master's in mechanical engineering at ETH Zurich. It's the technical university here. Yeah, so uh, that's it. And I'm still on my way to the Kreisbüro. Um, German accent is on point. Okay, last thing that's really cool about Switzerland is that they have these fountains everywhere, like actually everywhere. But the thing is, is that they're always running. And so it's not very good for the environment, but um, they, they're they like, oh yeah, but we have so much water, so it's fine. And I'm like, uh, okay, I feel like that's not how it works, but whatever, your country. My flame still doesn't work. So this is it. And it's terrible. So I'm currently doing this Instagram uh, STEM squad challenge. And the topic of today that you're, we're supposed to post a photo of is book. And what book am I reading today, do you ask? Turbulent Flows by Pope. So I'm studying for laser diagnostics still because um, engineering hates me. Uh, here it is, so much laser diagnostics. And everyone is outside at the street parade, which is apparently some big party on the streets in Zurich that people from all neighboring 
countries, I guess, come to to enjoy, and I'm inside. Okay, so we're at the street parade. I'm here with my friend David, and it's pretty uh, crazy. Okay, so this is the street parade. This is really, really, really intense. This guy, this guy right here. Wow. I'm like actually scared for my life. <laughs> Zurich is like never ever like this. All these people are dressed like cops and they're not actually cops. Those aren't real cops, but there are cops everywhere with guns. Okay, so this street parade is officially the scariest place I've ever been to on the planet. So many people. Okay, so the street parade yesterday was ridiculous. I couldn't even stay there for like more than 30 minutes because the entire floor was covered in vomit and beer cans and glass and people that were just sitting on the floor like with no shoes, lost their friends, lost their keys, lost their wallets, lost their phones, don't know where they're staying, don't know anything, pretty much, it was terrible. Um, so if you ever want to visit Zurich, do not come during the street parade, unless you want to be part of that. I don't know. So, what am I doing now then? I am studying laser diagnostics, because engineering is pretty much my life. Okay, I'm currently in the Google building. I'm in the James Bond room. It's like a secret room. Anyway, what am I doing in the Google building? I am studying laser diagnostics because once again, I have no life. Um, I can't film inside the other rooms of the Google building, but pretty much, what it is, is just a lot of free food, which is amazing, and ice cream, and all you can eat sushi, and coffee, and they just have like all of these cool themed rooms where people just sit around like in a cafe and work on their laptops. It's pretty cool. Or you can go to your desk and work, but I don't know, we're pretty much in this uh, James Bond room once again. All these... Uh, pretty cool. It's like behind a secret bookcase. It's all right. So I did my laser diagnostics exam this this morning and I'm pretty sure I passed. Well, I know I passed because the prof told me I passed. Um, it was an oral exam because they have those here in Switzerland. So in Switzerland they have these oral exams. They're 30 minutes and the prof pretty much um, they try to figure out what you know, not what you don't know, is what they said. But I'm pretty sure multiple times tried to figure out what I didn't know, so 